hello guys welcome back to the channel and so most of you guys are facing the issue on this particular lab so here is updated solution for this lab and in this video i'm going to show you the simplest way to complete this lab so first of all just me log in with your credentials and once you're done with that just me come back over here and activate your cloud shell it will take a couple of seconds meanwhile in the description box of this video i will share one github link just me click on that link and then you are able to access this document first of all what you do you have to copy this command come back over here paste hit enter wait for a second and then just me click on authorize now this command will take a couple of seconds meanwhile what you do come back over here scroll down a little bit and from here you can see all this file so just me open all this file in new tab like this way now come back over here and here you can see zip file so this file you have to download to your local system so just me click on this download button over here like this way and it will download now for the remaining file we have to use this letter now just me come back over here and from here you can see is done now just me open this link in new tab like this way wait for a second click on this close okay and then click on the start collection over here now for all this information again come back to the github repo scroll up and from here you can see collection id so just me copy this and paste over here now for the document id just simply type 100 now for the field name just me copy this name carefully and paste over here now for the field value just me copy this name and paste over here then click on this plus button over here now copy this last name over here like this way and paste over here now for the field value just me copy this name like this way just me copy like this and paste over here like this then again click on this add value again scroll down then copy this field name and paste over here make sure that your collection data must look like this okay field type must be this and value like this okay once done with all these things then click on the save only wait for a second and it's done now just me come back over here and from here you can see dialog flow console just me open this link in incognito window like this way wait for a couple of seconds click on the checkbox and then just me click on this accept over here then click on this create agent over here now for the agent name you have to just me come back to the live instructions and click on the task number two and from here you can see agent name so just me copy this name come back over here and paste now for the zone just me choose gmt minus seven over here you can see america denver just me choose that and from here just me choose your project id like this way and then click on this create button wait for a second And it's done now just me come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for the task number two and once you get a score on the task number two then only you have to move forward with another task so as you can see i got a score now again come back over here click on this gear icon then click on this export like this way and then click on this import from zip like this way and now you have to just me upload the file which is just download from my github repo this one then click on this open wait for a second and it's done now for here you have to just type import in capital like this way and then click on this import button wait for a second and again click on this done button over here and it's done okay now click on this fulfillment over here and then click on this toggle like this way make sure that your inline editor must be enabled then only you are able to edit the file now for the index.js set just me come back over here and from here you can see index.js so just me copy this file and paste over here like this way now for the packet.json just me copy this content you can see packet.json so just me copy this content and replace over here like this way and then just me click on this deploy button over here now it will take a couple of seconds so make sure that once it's done you have to check those score for the task number three and task number four i will let you know what score you have to check otherwise what happen you won't get a full score if you move forward to another task without checking the score for the task number three and task number four so just me wait for the, this deployment get complete
and it's finally done as you can see deployment complete now if we just me come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for the task number three and task number four you will get a score without any issue and once you get a score on the task number three just scroll down and then this check my progress then only you have to move forward another task otherwise what happened you won't get a full score over here and as you can see i got a green tick then only what you do just me come back over here and then click on this intent over here like this way then click on this name reservation over here scroll down and from here you can see fulfillment just me click over here and then just me turn on this toggle like this way and then click on this save again i am saying click on this fulfillment turn on this toggle and then click on this save once you're done with that now again come back to the github repo scroll down over here and from here you can see name now i request you please watch the video carefully as you can see try out this simulator so just me copy this name carefully and paste over here like this way and then hit enter button like this way once you do that it will ask like change your booking name okay now it's asking like sure just simply tell me your change name so for that what you do copy this name you have to copy only this name just simply copy this and paste over here like this way once you do that now it asking for the reservation number that time you have to just type 100 and again hit enter wait for a second and now it's again asking for the new name for the new name again just will paste the name which you just copy kelly and then click on this enter like this way once you follow this sequence then you will get output like okay i have updated the name and if you are not getting this kind of response then i will request to please rewind the video and just me watch what i did here okay once you get a, this kind of response now if you just me come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for the last task of this lab you will get a score without any issue it might take a couple of minutes to update a score but don't worry you will get a full score on this lab without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys